Some people lose all their hair for the simple fact that vegetarians are coming to dinner. Don't bother. Vegetables are wonderful. Today, I'm going to show you a pumpkin souffle that'll make you an instant hero with vegetarians. First step, slice the pumpkin like so. Thin slices. I want two textures, so we've got two ways of cooking the pumpkin. They're both easy. Pumpkin, steamer, boom. While the pumpkin's steaming, I want another texture in our souffle because I want it to be fantastic. Right. Diced pumpkin, hot oil in the pan. Let the pan heat up before you add the oil because then you need less oil. Always toss the pumpkin before adding the spices. Otherwise, you'll burn them. Okay, little bit of cumin, cinnamon, very Moroccan. Ground coriander, way different to fresh coriander. Tossing, not even looking, that is like taking a magic carpet ride to Morocco. Next thing, basic bechamel. Ignition, butter. Bechamel is chef speak for a really easy, simple white sauce. Right, butter melted, flour. Slowly add a bit of milk and mix to a paste for about five minutes. This is Perfect. Basic bechamel. Kids, do try this at home. Right, remember our steamed pumpkin? Mash, mash. Mosh, mosh. Some people mosh, I mash. Now, into our bechamel. Stir it in, add sea salt, white pepper, now we're ready for our egg yolks and some coriander. Now our diced, spiced pumpkin. This is the important rising part of a souffle with a heat and a few others, very important. Five egg whites, pinch of good salt. Whisk until you have lovely, soft, snow white very good exercise. If you get tired, change hands. Okay, we've beat some air into them. Then fold into the pumpkin mix. We're folding these in gently. We don't want to be knocking out the air. Great foldsmanship. That's not a word. Then it's into the ramekins. Make sure you paint them with a bit of butter and dust them with semolina. Next stop, our bay marine. So we're going to put our souffle moulds in there. I'm going to pour some water so it comes about halfway up the sides. Now, 210 degree preheated oven. I'll bake these for 30 to 35 minutes. Seriously, stupendous souffles. Moment of truth. Yes! <laughs> and voila, a vegetarian dish that isn't too tricky. You'll find this super easy souffle on the website and lots of other great veggie-friendly recipes in my book.